as a sustainable and more efficient mode compared to internal combustion engine vehicles. With ride hailing community urged to take up vehicles like that more often. Despite this, initial funding and taxation remain a barrier with stakeholders calling on the government to offer fiscal incentives to drive uptake. quite costly because one the taxes you know so this car is not as expensive as it is on the other side but by the time it comes into the country the price has appreciated significantly so we were having this conversation with this with the taxi association of kenya with uh, anticipation for the budget that is going to be released within the next few days. So we are hoping there's going to be tax reliefs from the government about this product. And more on, more beyond that, we are going to be setting up a plant here in Nairobi so we can bring in the vehicles in partially broken down format or completely broken down format so that we can make it cheaper. Because once they come in, we just put them together and sell them and they're going to be a lot, a lot cheaper. Just of taxation. Taxation is one of the key obstacles to ownership of these vehicles. Well, that's it for business today and for this week. My name is Peter Okaba. Just remind you that in a few short minutes, we'll be back in Bungoma for the sports. Do continue to enjoy the rest of your viewing.